The application of SPD are very extensive, such as residential, commercial, industrial, hospitals, etc. Let's take commercial applications in the TT network as an example. At the incoming distribution box, if the main air circuit breaker is 3,200 amperes, the upstream dedicated disconnector of SPD should use a 100 to 200 ampere circuit breaker or a 250 to 315 amperes fuse. SPD can be selected type 1. The cross-sectional area of the live and neutral wires should be 6 mm squared or above, and the grounding wire should be 16 square millimeters or above. The total length of the connections for L1, L2, and L3 should be less than 50 centimeters. At the outgoing distribution box, if main circuit breaker is 250 amps, the upstream dedicated disconnector of SPD should use a 100 to 125 amp circuit breaker or a 125 amp fuse. SPD can be selected type 1 plus 2. The total length of wiring between type 1 SPD to type 1 plus 2 SPD should be greater than 5 meters. At the main distribution box, if main circuit breaker rated at 200 amperes, the upstream dedicated disconnector of SPD should use a 50 to 80 amperes circuit breaker or an 80 amperes fuse. SPD can be selected type 1 plus 2. At the sub-distribution box, if main circuit breaker rated at 63 amps, the upstream dedicated disconnector of SPD should use a 32 to 40 amp circuit breaker or fuse. SPD can be selected type 2. At the sub-distribution box, if the main circuit breaker is 32 amps, the upstream dedicated disconnector of SPD should use a 20 amp circuit breaker or fuse. SPD can be selected type 2 plus 3. At the sub-distribution box, for surge protection of industrial control equipment, the upstream dedicated disconnector of SPD should use a 10 to 16 amp circuit breaker or fuse. SPD can be selected type 3. AC SPD wiring and installation need to be further analyzed in different applications. The above information is for reference only. LSP, Reliability in Surge Protection.